Congratulations, dumb and dumber. You've made the worst piece of fucking shit that I have ever seen. Oh my god. I don't know how you pulled it off. Oh my god, I'm so mad. What is up, my berserkers? It's your boy, Egg on the Berserker here, and this is part two of my season eight rant. <laughs> if you want to see part one, I'll have a link for it down below. And yeah, let's get this rant over with before I go insane. All right, so episode four. They've defeated the Night King in the Army of the Dead. Funeral scene. That's all right. But Bran says this line when he's talking with Tyrion that he doesn't want anymore. Like, what? What the fuck was that line? What was that line? At this point, Bran just becomes... An emotionless robot. He just becomes that. I wonder if it's like him spending years in a tree. And then him being stuck as an emotionless robot. Oh my god. That, that was awful. And then we get fan service of Jamie and Brienne having sex. Yay! Who wanted that scene? I bet nobody. I don't know if they're going to be a thing in the books. Or maybe in Winds of Winter that'll be a thing. But... <sighs> what they gave us is just fan service. I think that's the same for the John and Daenerys ship. Like... I think that's also fucking fan service, and I hated it. I hated it so much. And then Varys dies in a degrading way. He asks John since he knows, because John literally told everybody, even though Daenerys warned him not to do that, somebody must have told. Varys and Varys knows and that he'll obviously betray Daenerys but Jon says she's McQueen like I think that's one of only three lines that he says like uh you're McQueen I don't want it or just nothing and just stares at another character for like two hours Oh my god, this season's making me pissed. This just pissed me off so much. Oh yeah, also in this episode, Danny kind of forgot about the Iron Fleet. For no apparent reason at all. Except bad fucking writing. And oh yeah, to add shock factor... David and Dan decided to kill off Rhaegar for no apparent reason. Or was it Rhaegal? I don't fucking care. I don't fucking care. Either one. They decided to kill off Rhaegar because shock value. whoop de frickin do Yay. And then we have the scene where they captured Masande, and when they go to freaking King's Landing, it's a fucking barren desert. It looks like something out of Dorne. Oh my gosh. And King's Landing was like luscious and green, not this barren fucking wasteland. I don't know if, like, Simba came and took all the green when Cersei was ruling. Oh, my God. And then there's this tension. And Cersei wanted to kill 
freaking Tyrion because she thinks that Tyrion murdered Joffrey. And she was almost going to have some archers, like, do that. But she all of a sudden stops. Oh, my fucking God. Why? Why? Oh, my God. That That is just bad. And it also kind of adds an unnecessary will she, won't she moment. And... That's just fucking dumb. That's just dumb. In my opinion. Alright. Episode 5. And episode 5 is even worse. Because it fucking wasted Jamie Lannister's development all throughout the show. All throughout the show, Jamie Lannister was trying to become a better person and protect the innocents. But one line, one line ruined it. Ruin it. For some fucking reason, he says, I don't care about the innocents, the innocent all otherwise. What? After seven seasons. After seven seasons of character development. That just all of a sudden goes down the toilet. That goes down the shitter. Along with David and Dan's good writing ability. That's probably what I hated the most about season eight. And also Daenerys becoming the Mad Queen after... I don't know. Someone swung that out of left field and killing innocents? Like, what? What the fuck was that? And like, I get it. Cersei killed Masande. They should have done like a heroic um, Avengeance arc instead of this. Oh, Let's kill civilians. Let's burn them alive. And what Cersei was doing was like, Oh, I'm gonna stare out a window. Oh my god. Oh my god. This episode not only ruined one character, they ruined two. Through Jamie and Daenerys. Oh my god. That season was just awful. And Cersei has the scorpions all throughout. All throughout the fortresses of King's Landing. And nobody does anything. And just lets Daenerys burn stuff. Fuck the writing. And fuck the direction. Oh my god. And then this smug ass character called Urin Pissjoy thinks that he killed Jamie, but he should have said, I killed a dragon, instead of saying, I killed Jamie Lannister. No! Bricks killed Jamie and Cersei. Oh my god, this is dumb. And hey, remember Alaria Sand from season 5? Well, apparently she's dead because of Daenerys, because David and Dan forgot about her. Yeah. Alright, let's get to episode 6, the finale. And this one's even worse. The only good part was, like, Daenerys dying, so that way she won't be a part of Season 8 anymore. But after that, when Bran becomes king and says, Why do you think I came all this way? No. I don't think Bran even wanted to be king.
I don't think he even wanted to be king in the fucking first place. That should have been given to either, like, Jon Snow, because he was a Targaryen, or Gendry Baratheon. Not Bran Stark. A better ending for Bran would be for him to become the frickin' goddamn three-eyed raven. That's how the ending should have gone. <sighs> Season 8 is trash. It's just, it's just fucking trash. And then Bran sends Jon all the way back to the wall. I don't know why. And Grey Worm, like, should have tried to kill Jon. But Dumb and Dumber have no fucking clue on what they're doing. <sighs> My freaking god. This season. And everyone just agreeing that Bran needs to be king? What the fuck is wrong with you in the good story policy? Bran's story's like not even that interesting. Everyone else here, except for some other people, have more interesting stories than Brandon Stark. And the North decides to become independent. Since fucking when? Since fucking when? And that's a progress of lore that goes down the toilet. Oh my god, I'm, I'm just so mad right now. I'm just so mad that season 8's a thing. Oh yeah, and at the beginning of the episode, I almost forgot, after John killed Daenerys, Drogon should have killed John, but instead... Oh, I'm gonna burn down the Iron Throne. I'm gonna burn it down. Okay, John, we're cool. No! No fucking no! The Unsullied should be after John. The Dothraki should be after John. Dario Naharis and the Second Sons should be after John. Oh my god. And I forgot to mention this in episode 5, but Arya should have died at least multiple times. Multiple times. But plot armor. This season just full of plot armor and it's not even good. It's just not even good at all. Oh my god. Fuck. Season 8, fuck Dumb and Dumber, and just fuck the entire writing that, the writing staff that agreed to this shit. Fuck them all. Alright guys, thank you, thank you so much for watching, sub if you're into A Song of Ice and Fire or Dune, currently trying to make it to 300, like the video, comment your thoughts on season 8, and I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.